Welcome to the Daily App Show. Today we have an application for your iPhone as well as your iPod Touch called Clazer. Clazer is a stuff organizer designed to be your handy visual memory keeper. All of us take pictures to remember something, so why not use Clazer? You see right here from the main menu I have my collections. I've currently got some going on. I've got some favorite snacks that I want to remember. I've got some almonds in here. You can tap in there and I can see the full description of everything. I got a photo. And I've got descriptions, tags, and I've organized them in different categories. I've even got some nice soups so that I remember these are vegan soups that are good for you. And then I can even come and view some coffee that I'm starting to like as well. And down below there are places. So whenever I take a photo, it's going to tag it with a place. And you can see at the current location I have, I've taken 10 different photos. But if I were to move, say, go home or be a route and about, I can tag photos and it'll remember those places for me. So if I'm in the grocery store and I find a really nice bag of almonds and I tag it, I'll be remember to go back to that store and buy them. Tags are here where I can tag all my items with different tags, such as food, coffee. I've got some Keurigs and some Starbucks, and I can even add new tags. And then down below is a search where I can begin searching for items I'm looking for. You'll notice through each column that there's a plus button in the top right hand corner. That's how you add an item. Tap the plus button. Here you can give it a name, description, tag, and choose where you want it to go in the collection. So for this one, let's just say I'm going to take a picture of my Starbucks cup. Now I'm going to give it a description. I'm going to tag it. So this one I'll choose Starbucks and I can search for tags up here. I can create my own tags. This one I'll create one that's called T. I'll tap create. Now you see I've chosen two tags. So I can go ahead and do that, go back. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose inbox. And you see I have favorite snacks, vegan soups, or coffee. But I don't have an inbox for tea yet. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it just in my inbox. And I'm going to tap the camera and take a photo. I'll go ahead and use that photo and now what I'm going to do is tap save. So now it's saved it and it's in my general inbox up here, uncategorized. What I can do now is add a new collection and let's just call this one Tease. So now that I've got Tease ready to go, I'll come back to my inbox item, come into my new Starbucks thing and tap on inbox and now put it in my Tease category and now you see it's been updated. Now when I've got one created, I can tap the share button in the bottom left hand corner to share it with AirDrop, Mail, Messages, Facebook, Twitter, or anything like that so it'll open up your regular iOS share menu and enable the settings you have enabled. So now we'll come back out and you see our inbox is empty, but now we have a new collection called Teens. So this is going to be great if you want to keep organization of the books you've lent out or schedules or gym or yoga, anything like that. So you don't have to use it for foods. I'm just giving you an example of what I was using it for to kind of categorize things around me. You can tap edit in the top left hand corner and you can rearrange your stacks or delete them. So you hit the delete button, I can now delete it. Or I can use the right hand column and I can rearrange my collections. Now I can come into places and tap into place and see all of the photos I have. So there are all of the different items. I can change the view to a grid or a list up in the top right hand corner. And you can also do that in your collection. So when you're in a collection and I come in here, you see the list. I can do the list or a grid view. You'll notice that plus button's always right up there in the top right hand corner. So I can quickly add anything to one of my collections. And then in tags, if I tap in tags, I can see the different items that I've tagged with that specific tag. I can add a new tag with the plus button down here. And I can go ahead and change my view format to list or grid as well. And then search, if I was looking for something, say coffee, I'll just type it in. And as I'm typing in, you see it highlights the word and it shows me the two things or more that I'm looking for in those categories. So once again, this application is called Clazer. If you like it, be sure and pick it up in the App Store today.